my channel if you're new here my name is Brooklyn I'm currently here living in Orlando Florida doing the Disney College program and um, I kind of just started doing Sunday vlogs I don't know why I'm not really doing vlogs any other day of the week but Sunday it is so um, it's Sunday obviously just got back from church uh, my hair was down and like I had it like flipped back it looked kind of really cute um, wearing a pink dress but I just had to throw my hair up in like a claw clip. So like half of it's up in a claw clip and the rest is just down. That's why it looks a little shorter right now. But um, yeah, I'm home. I went to the grocery store and got some stuff to make pancakes. So I think we're gonna make pancakes. Pancakes for Palm Sunday. <laughs> and then I have work at 5.30, so I need to leave here at 4.30. I have my first load of laundry going now. I'm gonna try to do two loads before I have to leave. It's about 1.30 right now, I think. Um, so yeah, that's what we're gonna do. Kind of do a little spring cleaning. Our apartment smells really disgusting and I cannot figure out what it is. So we're gonna try to figure that out. Um, but yeah, let's go make some pancakes. Um, and I'll tell you all about how the house service went today. Okay, so I'm not sure how much you're gonna be able to see because of where I have you set up, but making pancakes, this is the mix I got. I don't think I've ever used that mix. So we'll see if it's good. Um, but I'm going to make half of the batch. Oh, well, no, I can't because I have to use one whole egg. I guess I'm making a full batch. That's going to be a lot of pancakes, but maybe I can put some in the fridge and take them to lunch or something. But one batch of says makes eight pancakes, and these are just for me. So we're going to open this. This is really hard to open. Hello? Okay. Anyhow, getting this open. Um, church went really good today. We had a really good service. Um, really good altar call. Just overall really good. Um, today's Palm Sunday, if you did not know. Um, I was gonna wear something green, but I really didn't have anything green I wanted to wear for Palm Sunday, so I decided to just go with pink. Um, the songs today were a little bit older which is different. Usually our church is like really, really like does like newer songs. So it was nice hearing some older songs. One of them I had no idea what it was. I was like, I've never heard this song in my entire life. Um, I can't even remember how it went. But anywho, that went well. There, um, what was I gonna say? Oh, for Sunday school, I'm gonna show back just a little bit more so I can like talk better and like still do things. Um, there we go. But during Sunday school, we were supposed to do a certain lesson, but like the person that was teaching was like, honestly, we're not going to do that today. It's Palm Sunday. We're going to, we're going to review Easter. So he like talks for five minutes on what the lesson was supposed to be about and then pulls out a quiz all about the crucifixion and the resurrection. Hmm. And I was like, oh, I'm gonna ace this. It was 17 questions. Some of them had multiple answers. So like one of the questions had five answer choices and four of them were correct and you had to figure out which one was not correct. It was very tricky. Um, how much should I just put in there? So two or three, three or four screws. We'll do one more. Um, anyway, it was very tricky. I did very horribly, but so did everyone else. So that's okay. Um, I realized that I did not know as much about the crucifixion and the resurrection as I thought I did. Um, it was like really specific questions like, who did Jesus talk to on the road to somewhere? Um, which of the following things happened um, to Jesus on the cross? Which of the following things did the soldiers see? Which of the following things did the soldiers do? Um, what things preceded the resurrection? Um, and it was like, the answer was like Mary Magdalene saw him um, and like a bunch of other stuff like that. Um, one of the ones was where did the ascension take place? Um, who carried the cross for Jesus? Who did Jesus talk to on the way to the cross? Um, and different things like that. So it was honestly pretty hard. So what we're going to do is I'm going to take this week just to kind of review that part of the Bible, because apparently it's not something that I like know a lot about, which is very disheartening for some reason. Like, I was so upset. I was like, are you kidding me? I know that little about the Bible, 
but I guess it's just one of those things that like, you're like, yeah, I know that. And you don't really study it because you like have been taught it your whole life, but you don't like study like the little facts. And the little facts are what got me. Um, three fours. One. Two. Three. And I'm too scared to pull them all the way up, so we're gonna do a tiny little bit more. Boop. All right, let me get the egg in. together. Um, yeah, so that's how Sunday school went. I learned I do not know as much as I thought I did. Um, me and one of the girls I went to Bible college with went to this church and um, we were both like, did we learn nothing in Bible college? But, like, it's weird. Like, in Bible college I learned a lot about like intercultural relationships because I, um, and like how to like be a missionary and like how to like interact with cultures respectfully um, because that was my major but and like i like took like new testament survey which like went over the whole new testament but like these the questions just were not things that like i like knew and i was so upset but the girl that went to Bible college with me too she also did not know so i was like okay well you know what i don't feel too bad um but yeah maybe you realize i need to study that a little more so we're gonna do that um and then this is really lumpy. What was I talking about? Like I keep like half finishing sentences and not finishing them. Oh, um, actual service, like worship service went really well. Um, he talked about the stones crying out um, and how um, the stones would cry out in our place, you know, um, and like the stones have seen the miracles, um, you know, the stones, like he d mentioned, like, you know, the stone that David used to kill Goliath. He mentioned the stones that were going to be thrown at the woman who was caught, um, in adultery and how, um, when Jesus stopped them from throwing stones at her and like, it was all about how, um, yeah, these stones have like seen all these amazing things happen. However, they're not the ones who experienced it. You know, we humans, men and women, have seen it and experienced God's grace and all these wondrous works. So we are the ones that should, sorry, there was an eggshell. So we're the ones who should be like praising him. It was really good. Yeah, there was tongues and interpretation. Um, worse, like altar call was really long. Um, Kind of stayed after altar call and kind of just like you know sat for a little bit and thought and wrote a little bit in my journal so yeah really good service can't wait for this weekend we don't have a wednesday night service because we have a friday night service we're gonna have a good friday service so we're not doing wednesday night so it'll be a little longer before i'm back in church but that's okay i am going to be, um, I am going to be at that service though. I'm not going to miss it. So that's nice. I actually got that off on my schedule. I didn't even have to trade it. So that's nice. I am scheduled Easter Sunday. I'm not scheduled to like 345 though. So I could still go to church. Part of me just doesn't want to work on Easter. Um, you know, at all. So I'm gonna try to get that off. Also, I put chocolate chips in my pancakes. Does anyone else do that? Mm -hmm. Oh no, they all got caught in the whisk. Okay. Oh no. I'm gonna go ahead and make these on the frying pan and then I'll show you them when they're done. 
It is done. This is a really big one that I made, and then I burnt a few others, and then I have chocolate milk. So let's see. I do not understand the flamingo stoves at all. I always burn things with them. It's like they get crazy hot, but if you don't turn it up, it doesn't get hot at all. It's crazy, but I'm gonna eat really quickly. All right, y'all. My room is a wreck. So. Um, we're going to spend the next few minutes cleaning it up. Um, also, my pancakes were not done all the way through, but they were burnt. So, I'm going to have to figure out this stove. It's every time I use it. I think I did use a different eye than I usually do. Usually I use like the left eye, but for some reason tonight, I'm going to use the right eye. Maybe that has something to do with it. I don't know. But So, my pancakes weren't too good, but it's okay. I still got to eat something, which is all that matters. Um, I have laundry going in. I put in my second load. <sighs> my room is a mess. I really need to like do a deep clean. But I think I'm gonna do is get everything off the floor, put away my clean laundry, because I have clean laundry from like three days ago that's still sitting in the hamper that's not been folded. Um, and then I need to like put a few things away and just like get it all together. So we're gonna do that. I'm gonna do that really quickly. Wow. <laughs> So I'm gonna do that really quickly. Um, and yeah, a lot of people asked me a bunch of questions in my last vlog, so thank you, and gave me a bunch of suggestions about what they want to see for future videos. So I'm kind of thinking about maybe doing a live here in a few days um, and answering a bunch of questions during a live. Maybe we'll see what happens. But yeah, I'm gonna clean my room and then I'll show it to you once it's all clean. I'm not gonna show it to you in the state it's in right now because that's embarrassing, but I will clean it and then I will show you the final product and then we'll get ready for work. Also, it's like really cold outside right now. I think I'm gonna wear my big jacket to work tonight. Like that's how cold it is, but let's clean. All right, y'all, it's much later. Um, I have to leave in like 20 minutes. Um, I'm not changed yet, but I did get my room clean. So I'm gonna show you that really quickly. Can't show you my bed because it's still not made, but everything else is. So let's show so you what, what this area looks like. It was so cluttered before. Now everything has its place again. Looks great. I have not put that pillow up or fixed this. I have my little Easter thing for my church, like a little invite there. This all looks so much better. Put up a new pair of ears I got. This looks not that great. Um, I did put... I put this on like a week ago. It says he is risen. Ignore the blankets and stuff on the bed. Um, it has some crosses, some flowers. It's really cute. Um, over here I have my Dr. Pepper, my cup, this, and then this. This actually goes down here. Um, but yeah, so everything is in its place. I put all my yarn and stuff right here. So, Not perfect. Yeah. And like I said, I have to get ready for work. So we're gonna have to go ahead and go. Um, I did put something right there on my roommate's dresser because she left. Um, and I need somewhere to put it, so I'm gonna get there until I find a box. My box is under my bed and I don't feel like getting it out, but I'm gonna go ahead and get changed, get ready for work. All right, I'm all ready. Let's go to work. All right, y'all. It is like 12.30 maybe, one o'clock, I really don't know. I got home from work just now. I um, have not looked at the time. It might actually be like 12.15. It's after midnight, I know that. I'm tired, so I'm gonna take a shower really quickly. Um, probably have some cookies and milk for dinner. Very nutritious. Um, and then I'm gonna go to bed. So yeah, that was my Sunday. Um, I'm posting this tomorrow. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna try to edit it while I'm getting ready for bed today. Edit this so that it's posted for tomorrow. Um, yeah. I have been looking at some of the comments on the past few videos. I'm loving some of your guys' ideas for future videos. Um, so look out, you might see some of those coming up. I um, did, gotta play with my sunscreen. Um, I kind of want to do something like since it's Easter week and like all that, do something on here for that. Like maybe like a daily like short um with like a little verse of the day like a one minute little like bible to be like devotional snippet i don't know i'm gonna think about it and pray about it tonight and see if i want to do that and if so also I'll start that tomorrow morning um but you'll find out um so yeah i'm hopefully gonna do something for easter like for y'all content wise um on actual Easter, I do have to work that night at like five something. 
but I'm trying to give the shift away. And if I can't give it away, I might just call out and take the point because I don't know, just working on, working on Easter just does not seem like, I don't want to <laughs> like that is like, Every day is a day to celebrate the resurrection and like every day is God's day. Obviously every day is Jesus' day. But like I feel like Easter is like, I don't want to work on Easter. So I'm going to try to give that away. Um, but yeah, I'm going to go ahead and sign off for the night so I can get to bed. So thank you so much for watching. If you're not already, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to my channel to stay up to do all the content that will be coming soon. And I'll catch y'all in the next one.